When you notice a person in trouble, you feel the urge to step in and help. That's exactly what a Reddit user planned on doing after he overheard a guy threatening the girl he was out on a date with. But as he wanted to head toward the couple, a man came closer and said, I have this. What happened next is sort of amazing and restores our faith in humanity. So possibly one of the coolest things I've ever seen. I mean, you know how you hear the women want him, men want to be him stuff in old movies? Well, I'm a man and by God, I wanted to be this guy. Anyway, I'm having dinner with my girlfriend at the time and behind us are a couple on a date. It's not going well. Guy was being rather creepy and making some pretty inappropriate comments. The girl doesn't look at all comfortable. The girl finishes her appetizer really quickly. My guess is she wanted to get it over with. Guy proceeds to comment on it and says, well, at least I know you can swallow, right? Loudly. Girl goes red and tells him that it isn't appropriate. He literally waves his hand in a shoe-type motion and says, Oh, calm down. I was going to find out in a few hours anyway. I missed her exact reply as she moved to a hushed tone, but it was fairly obvious what was being said. F no, F off, F this. He responded with, Sweetheart, I picked you up. I know where you live. She lost the color in her face and said nothing. I'm not one of those get involved types of people. There's no way I'm sitting here watching this go down. I get up. I don't know what I'm going to do, but I'm 23, fighting fit, and happy to put that guy through a wall. I was halfway out of my chair when a hand comes down on my shoulder, and I look up at this mid-50s but super fit guy who says, easy, I've got this one. Absolute, total confidence in his voice. He walks over, grabs a nearby chair, flips it around, and sits down with the couple. Then he pulls out his police ID and puts it on the table. Now the guy doesn't have any color in his face. Cop. So I'm quietly celebrating my daughter's birthday with my family when I distinctly hear you threaten this young lady. Would you care to explain yourself? Guy. I, uh, well, um, you see, cop. That's what I thought. Now see, we take a very dim view of that kind of thing. So right now I'm deciding if I want to have some of my buddies come pick you up. Guy. Oh no, well that, cop. But that would disrupt everyone's dinner. So how about you hand me your ID, because I wouldn't want you running off on me. Then you go see one of the staff here and settle your bill. The full bill, now, this young lady shouldn't go hungry on account of your poor behavior. Or we can go with the first option. I'll leave it up to you. Guy. No, no, that's perfectly fine. Hands over ID, gets up and walks very quickly in the direction of the counter. Cop, while writing down the guy's details, Sorry about that, miss. I hope I'm not intruding, it just seemed like you could use some help. Oh, and don't worry, if you want to pursue this further, I'll have some of the boys pick him up on his way home. We can definitely take this further. Girl. No, thank you so much. I wanted to run out 30 minutes ago, but he drove me here. Cop shifts from hard ass to comforting father figure in about half a second. Well, I'm here with my daughter. She's about your age. Perhaps you'd like to finish your meal with us. We can take you home afterwards if you'd like, unless you'd prefer to call someone. Girl. Oh, that'd be really nice. Thank you so much. Guy returns. So does the cop. Guy. Uh, so I've paid the bill if I could have my ID back. Cop. There you go. Now I have your details right here, so I highly recommend you don't go near or contact this young lady ever again guy yes yes of course i'm so sorry the guy pretty much fled the restaurant the girl went and sat with the cop and his family and by the time we left they were sitting around talking and laughing about random crap it was hands down the best way i've ever seen anybody handle any situation ever that cop is my hero we believe the cop acted the best way possible and couldn't handle the situation any better. Would you do anything differently? What do you think?